Mm, do come in. So, what are you aiming for today? Extra, extra. All your newsworthy needs in one paper. Over here! <laughs> here. Maybe this is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. Well, I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Tracks delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. And poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Gets some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. The feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. And we need him alive. That's an important point. Alive, I got it. Good, sure. Good evening, partner. Easy. Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. 
Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard him. I heard good things. I'll pay in gold if you could help me find him. It's just my mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, if it's for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. I'm a healer, you know, a medical man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. I'm taking you in. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. There's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Come on, partner. That's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This... this is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Hold on. I'm slipping. Shit. Please. Oh, oh, oh you saved me. Now, come on, buddy. Let's make this easy. What, you taking me in? It's just for questioning. Oh, hey, you saved my life! Well, ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping. I, they expressly told me not to kill you. What? Oh, this is about you. <sighs> Don't jump! Oh, 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 what? You can't shoot me! Oh. Please. I'll take my chance. Come here! Uh, bye, friend! I really do not like you. Ha!
I must be suffering from exposure. <laughs> Suffer a little longer. blacking out. Oh, sir, I must warn you, my temperature is subnormal. I have medicine in my pocket. Would you pass it to me, please? Yeah. You do seem to keep blacking out. Oh, sir, this isn't necessary. I'm a medical man, a healer. It's all just a big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to shut up. Why, who made you judge? <laughs> I'm only in it for the money. Oh, I don't feel well at all. You're a bully, sir. <clears throat> More and that's oh my lord, I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mrs. Calthorpe was uh, was just leaving. Sure, where you want him? I'm selling the back. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. But I told but you. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. If you ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner. I've already forgotten. Now, sir, um, how much was you offered? Uh, $50. Here. Thank you. Madam. Now, please, remember what I told you. Welcome. Come on in. Can I get a room, please? Room's all yours. Head on up. Sleep well? Thank you.
appreciate you stepping in there. Those bastards been turning the screw on me from day one, saying I gotta pay them protection money. I told them where to stick it, and well, I guess you just saw how that panned out. You watch yourself, all right? Stay out of trouble. I'll try. What happened to you two? Tower us like dogs. You wouldn't give us no guns, Pa. This is the worst idea I've ever had. We're with you on that. Don't feel you have to hang around on my account. Okay, girl. There, girl. Clear off. You idiots really want to die over a crossing? Shoot the fool!
Mr. Downs! Downs! Where are you? Downs! Oh, Mr. Downs! Mr. Thomas Downs? Yep, that's me. You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm... 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 We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm... I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts... I'm... I'm not running anywhere. I'm... I'm... I'm, do, I'm doing my best for you. You are a slippery little bastard. But I got you now. Please. Please, show some compassion. Please. Drowse told me you needed a beating. You saying he was right? What will that solve? Pay the money. Be reasonable. <laughs> <sighs> You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman! My husband isn't well! If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money!
Mr. Morgan. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. Glad to be off that mountain, Mr. Pearson. Yes, indeed. Lots to do now. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, you saved my life, and I'm... Well, I'm very grateful. Don't mention it, Reverend. I, I made a fool of myself. We've all done it. I just... I just... I get so confused and, and angry, and then I, I hear God laughing at me, and I get even angrier, and, well, I'm a real prized dolt. I know it. I am mighty glad to be out of that cold, Mr. Morgan. Me too. Oh. Hey there. Morning. So, still glad you fell in with this bunch? I think so. Most of the time. They're not so bad. Okay, then. Morning. Morning, Arthur.
My arms is gonna fall off. How are you doing? How do you think I'm doing? I'm sorry. Just let me know if there's anything I can do. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Okay.